What's up, people? What's up, explorers? So, me and Marky, Cara, she's driving my car. How'd you feel about that? She feels fine about that. <laughs> She'd be privileged anyway. I should be charging you to drive my car. <laughs> I'm only joking. Guys, we're heading to an old house. We don't know nothing about it apart from. No, we don't know anything about it apart from this thatch roof and it's very dated and there's so many cool things inside. And this guy's lived there his entire life. So, and it's not ramsacked, not trashed. It's, it just looks so cool. Mark's excited, I know he is. He's been literally giggling in the back like a kid. <laughs> oh, we're not going to the toy shop, bro. We're going to turn down the house. <laughs> Guys, enjoy the video. We're nearly there. We're shooting five, yeah, five, ten minutes. Let's go. Before we start this video, the duck, Poppy, should be in here somewhere. You need to find her. Let's get on. You ready? Yep, so the guys are literally coming straight through. Well, we didn't come through the front door, but the back window's completely rotted out, falling out. Um, I'm excited. This place looks incredible. I'm not even just saying it, either to keep your attention there. You just want... No. <laughs> Why'd you keep asking me? I think it's not like people farting, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, this looks such a cool house, and it's so overgrown. I cannot stress. Let's go. Everything's here, the binocular bags, another binocular, oh, that's an old fashioned, I'm not sure. <laughs> what are these bro? Danish chopped pork ham, oh little oh, tubs. I what these are. Oh, what if a body just dropped down on us? Oh, oh okay. It. I might try and check that out in a minute. And in here, so as you come through the front door, you've got your little toilet on the right. And you get straight into this little kitchen. Wow, bro, look how much stuff's in here. It's incredible. Oh, it? It's so beautiful. What's upstairs like? There's only a couple of rooms. The bedroom's quite nice. These are like a side thing. I'm just literally, I can't blown away how much, how beautiful this little place is. I really like this little place. I yeah. love the way the ceilings are quite low. There's a big old beam running through here. And this is a fat roof house. Look at that relying on the hot water as well. Just a little heater tank. <laughs> that makes it look fun. Yeah. That's probably like, it helped with the insulation. Yeah, maybe. I like that. Want some biscuits, anyone? 219. Really? No way. This place has been white empty nearly two years. Oh, okay, let's have a walk through. I'm loving this though, like it's a proper little workshop in his kitchen. Yeah, he's got his little desk lamp, little vice. Well, it could be her, I'm not saying just him. Oh, mate, how cute that little, little lamp is. It's cool, isn't it? And pictures. I'm not sure what these are for. I don't know if they're like little. I don't know, extraction bits or something. Maybe. You know, you love all the old first, twisted yeah. old wire. That's that stuff again, you know, from the cooker fat. This kitchen is absolutely incredible. I love it. This little old style kitchen. Come on, give me a tour around. Give me a tour around here. Well, there's the bathroom. So look, we've got a little car over there. And the bathtub. Everything's here, even the false teeth. It's still here. I 
love these old little bottles there. Uh, White's tincture. Never heard of that chalk block. Straight out of the kitchen. Straight into yeah, like the little old living room. There's so much beautiful stuff in this little place. It's so gorgeous. Old school. Like everything is so old. Little ashtray. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Wow, look at the old lamp light, the old gas lamp. Sorry, do. Give me your views, what do you think? At 1947, look how old that calendar is. Sorry. ceiling. There's so much stuff in this place. I don't want to move paperwork. I've made this mistake before. I love this old gas lamp. I think it's incredible. So you think that this is like an old type uh, table lamp. So you'd have the gas bottle maybe running down underneath. The old book cabinet. And look how old this cabinet is as well. You can tell when stuff's not old, it's really old because of the way it's finished and I won't touch it in case I break it. So again, so maybe that was like the living room, this is like the yeah, yeah, dining room, nice. sorry, living room, dining room, yeah. and this is the living room. This is part of like a, looks like the front of a grandfather clock. I love this chest, look at this chest guys. Solid old wooden box. Wow, look at the radio. So I'm trying to picture, imagine the, like, the really old sort of radio playing. And uh, him or her sitting on the piano. And the piano is at Bucklands, Regent Street. Beautiful is that picture. And that. Uh... Oh, I remember the old Happy Shopper stuff. Look at that. There's a garage here as well, but it's so overgrown out the back, literally. It was like a jungle to get in into it. You ready to retire? <laughs> oh, guys, look at this bedroom. Oh, wow. Oh, guys, this bedroom, look at this. Beautiful old house. Just keep an eye on that there for me a minute, bro. Look at this. Mark, it's incredible here. The way the fat truth's damaged as well. There's so many books as well. There's St. Paul Network. Harrison Behind the Lines. So obviously look, just come through the curtain there. I don't know what happened to my video, it clipped. Look, everything's still here. What's that? Full one pound. You don't see stuff like that anymore, do you? And I think this is actually quite offensive to put on the jar as well now. Sorry if that offends anyone guys, it's just obviously we're just saying it's here and you know, it's the last thing we want to do. It's like they've stored stuff in this room. It's 
absolutely beautiful though this place. So just coming back into the bedroom. And the little clock stopped at 20 past four. The beautiful paint in there, look at that. Shame it's not in a frame. So I've not found any names yet or like no. if it's a guy or I mean I'm I'm kind of going towards a guy that lived here. And it's so heavy as well, you feel the quality of the um just the wood and all that. And this doll. She's kind of happy but so old. The old telephone. You know, you've got some chocolate pops. Oh, that's so cool, bro. Look at that. Fries, uh, shilling chocolate, vanilla flavour, three penny cakes. <laughs> that is so absolutely beautiful. I'm just in love with this place, I really am. And it's just blessed to get to see these places. Obviously I'll not be sharing this out to anyone guys, so please, please don't drop me any messages. I don't mean to be horrible, it's just, I just want to try and respect places and leave this exactly how it was. I mean, everything can stay exactly how it was and no damage whatsoever. And this bed is like absolutely beautiful. And these wardrobes, everything's like the quality and stuff. And that, I'm not gonna go through it all, but everything's still in there. Sorry? Pretty sturdy furniture. Hmm? Pretty sturdy yeah, furniture. It is. That's what I mean. Look at the, the quality of that bed. And look at it. It's solid. Let's have one more look over here quick before we go. Let's see what other little books. Oh, look at that chest. Didn't see that there. I don't know how I could have missed it, but sometimes you just walking around, you're looking at everything and you're like, wow, 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 something else. You know, so out of the main room, out of the main room, guys. And you can see just outside how overgrown this place really is. I mean, it is so thick out there. Oh, look at this. It's kind of made a speaker out of the uh, cardboard box. There's some books here. What's this? Mark and Mass. Magical, magic instorated uh, dictionary. Oh, wow, what is this? Guys, drop in links below. Let me know what this is. It's a communication receiver. There you go. <laughs> Made by Philips. The old alarm clock. Wow, look at the old hairbrushes. So many antiques in this place. This needs to stay safe and sealed. I'm going to do my best to try and get in touch with someone to kind of let them know that this place is completely open at the moment. The realistic. What is this? It's an old manual tuning or something. Right here. It's like really old loads of documents or old electronics. Old receipts. There you go, it's the second man's jacket I've seen, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at these old belts. You really can, it doesn't, it doesn't smell horrible and it smells like really old in there. I can, a really antique, it smells like, yeah, like an old antique shop. Which is absolutely beautiful. What a gorgeous house. <laughs> the old button. Gal's Pure Country Honey. Look at his little hats. Oh, look at the little wardrobe, but then there's... I don't know if that's like a female's dressing gown there. So maybe him and her lived, 
here and obviously she was the last one to pass away. Don't know what the hell that is in that jar. I don't wish to find out either. RCA receiving tube. It's cool man. Something just draws me to this room. I absolutely love this room. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this is. I know I'm just coming back to this here. It's like some kind of old fashioned like jug or something. Right here. Surface with darling. I take the free. The silence of the north. I swear I've heard of that novel before in quite a few houses. Oh, that is a beautiful picture here. It's an incredible bro. It is absolutely gorgeous mate. Standing back on the staircase. Look at these old, the, all the old beams and you think the support, the thatch roof above us. Like the old glass up there. Do you each one of these paintings as well? They will tell a story. Oh yeah, look. Oh yeah, look at that. I think that's, is it a 1V, is that a 5 or a 6? Or am I completely wrong? Let me know, I'm probably totally wrong on that. It's actually still got the marking. That's cool, bro. Little boy and his dog. Love this mirror, you can kind of check your hair as you're coming down. <laughs> Make sure you're ready for and set for the day. So just coming back down the stairs. We're going to now head through this way again into the living room. We've definitely missed a room. Oh, look at this old clock. Old fashioned keys on the key hook. just because there's a main road right there. Oh yeah. Oh look at the little lathe. He's a proper sword. Definitely feel like he's like an engineer sort of person. Sir Gibble. The aeroplane. Tons of old books. I'm going to possibly not do a lot in this room because I'm so close to the road. This little pipe, medium dry. Wow, this is absolutely beautiful. This is probably my favourite little bit of furniture in the house. It's own little writing desk. Oh, wow, little old fashioned so bottles in there. It is like a, yeah, I think that's like a blank. Oh no. Use only oil. I don't know what that is. Look at that, the old premium ink. You can imagine just sitting here now with the old fountain pen. So many beautiful things. Here's that, his little, so you think he was probably working in this little room. Not doing his little chill room, is it? Yeah. Big books, sitting on the fire, listening to music. Don't want to lean behind that. The old fashioned phones. Maybe it's like communication person fixing because there's a lot of old phones there around there in bits. Okay. It's an absolutely beautiful place. Uh, yeah, do, do, old Morse code. So, okay. So this place was a Mr. <laughs> On the occasion of your retirement after 29 years service, I extended from May 19th, May 1941. To January 1971, hmm? I'd like to take the opportunity to thank you for your long and faithful service. Have given the Navy. Ooh. This guy served the long, the long fall in the Navy. I'm not going to show too much, but this is what this is for. It's got the guy's name. I mean, it might have been his father, I don't know, but by looking at this house, I would definitely say it was his father. Grand, it was his father. His name is James. James, yeah. Which this is James as well. <laughs> but yeah, it's a beautiful place. Her Majesty the Queen. 
was certified. Oh yeah. So that he was doing attended course of lectures attended. and demonstrations in first aid has been examined and satisfied the examiner in the said subject in accordance with the regulation of society. That's so cool, isn't it? This is amazing. There's so many things a reading like to do with the army of James. more communication um, so he's very into his old like military communication stuff and old phones <laughs> so cool I love the old light I'm assuming it reminds me of like the old ship lights Oh, you smell the old oil, can you? Oh, yeah. Swords, hell Is that one of those? I thought it was an old siren. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous place, eh? Yeah, even fun. It really is. What do you think of your views? I, f I feel like he was here on his own. Could be. And you feel that? Seems more of a manly house, but yeah. you never know, do you? Yeah, so me and, Mark are, me and Mark are literally just thankful we get to see these gorgeous places. So much history in this house. It's it's just getting dark now and we don't want to upset it's anyone. It's old, old, isn't it? So we're going to try and show you a little bit more about this place. We could be here all day going through everything, but that's the thing. We don't want to get in trouble. We don't want to upset anyone. We have not broken anyway, but I'm just going to carry on. <laughs> Sorry? The neighbours are watching. Look. That spoon is so cool. Why it's been bent up. And the guy there just kind of staring at me. I'm still in love with this gas lamp. I think it's cool. <laughs> There's a wall with little drill bits. It's not really modern, modern. There's nothing modern. Guy, uh, have, you, have you seen a TV or? No. That's, no. That's, that's what I was saying. So it's there's no really TV. Modern, it's like he literally entertained himself by <laughs> fixing stuff, repairing stuff. And again, there, look. I won't show enough if there's a postcode on there, but it's his name on there as well. The old torch. Loving these beams. And look how the English houses are made as well, just all kind of <laughs> nothing straight. And that's what gives these properties such a good, like, character. This little shandy. What are these are? Everything as well. The door frames. Everything's kind of pieced. <laughs> pieced. Pieced. in the kitchen. God, that's something that have been so long there. Little jars of ginger marmalade. So beautiful. It just makes me think that what I always try and visualise when I'm doing these videos, it's not about 
for me it's not about getting the best content, it's not about the best houses. What it is for me is the respect that me and Mark have got for exploring how we love these places. We treat them exactly like their own. And also, mm. we always try and picture about the person spending his life here and what he did. You can imagine it. <laughs> <laughs> the kettle boiling. <laughs> she made me jump. Oh, that does a good job. Probably out connections. No, I've already been in the kitchen, but I just want to come back. Look at that, the old Hoover. So cool, man. I don't want to move too much because I don't want a car and boot. Car and boot. Yeah, look. I mean, this is the newest newspaper by the looks of it. It's 2019. I'm shocked that this has only been empty for just over, uh, just under two years, uh, just over two years. Sorry? I ain't seen a toilet. It's next to your behind you, isn't it? No, it's bathroom. Oh, there's no toilet there? No. Oh, unless it's an outside toilet. I don't know, it's easy to put one up at the top of the two stairs. Yeah. Oh, I kind of want to open the hatch. <laughs> I love the old drying racks. I see a lot of these in the old country homes. The only thing that I do find with these really old houses is just the, how dark it is, don't you? Yeah. It's like really dark and dingy. Yeah, it's small windows and We're out of the house. Um, at the end of the day, we didn't want to disrespect anyone, so we left straight away. Uh, we left, so the video's as long as we could take. Um, so, guys, we left the house. As, as, I mean, it's state of me. Uh, I videoed as much as I could. I didn't want to upset anyone. Um, it's a really quiet little town. Apparently, they know everyone up here, so we look suspicious enough in a little black golf in roads where there's Maseratis and everything around. But what a cool house. Hopefully you enjoyed that. To me, absolutely loved it. Um, I said to us on the way out as well, thanks James for letting me look in your home. And uh, yeah, absolutely loved it. But yeah guys, remember to hit that like and subscribe. It means the absolute world to us. And uh, don't forget to check out uh, the Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. All the links are in description. I try and write a bit of history of what I can find out about this place, so do check the description out all the time in all the videos. Love you all, stay safe and see you soon.